Have you ever been stranded in the woods or on the trail after blowing a tire? A lot of people have. Well, Super ATV offers a heavy duty spare tire carrier for the Kawasaki KRX. And today we're gonna show you how to get it installed. So let's get to it. So the first thing you're gonna do is go ahead and remove all four screws out of your clamp. We've already pulled two out and loosen the other two. So we'll just go ahead and completely remove them and set our hardware to the side. I'm just gonna kind of get everything right here. It's just gonna make it easier on me to get everything started. And then what I like to do is we'll grab the spare tire carrier. We're gonna slide it to the outside and then push it up and in. Just kind of get it flipped up here. You can use your air box to kind of help you hold it. That's what I found works best. And once you get it in position, just get your hardware lined up. And I like to just go ahead and get my Allen socket here. Just spin them down. You start them across from each other, kind of like in an X pattern. So once you got two screws started on one side, we'll go ahead over to the opposite side. And we'll just take it, slide it up onto our cage here. Get our hardware all lined up. Go around, we'll get all of our hardware started. So we got all four started on this side, we'll get the rest started on the opposite side. Once we have all of them started, we'll start running them all in. Get our ratchet out, or your Allen wrench, doesn't matter. Whatever you prefer. Just wanna make sure you close the gap evenly. Once you get your gap closed, then you'll just go through and fully tighten them in an X pattern. Repeat the steps for the opposite side. And there you have it. Once you have all your hardware fully tightened, that's how super quick and easy it is to install Super ATV spare tire carrier on this Kawasaki KRX. For more information on this spare tire carrier or any of Super ATV's great products, feel free to give us a call at 855-743-3427 or check us out online at superatv.com. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you next time.